My name is King. I'm five years old. I'm fighting leukemia. And King is homeschooled. Because I don't want to get the measles. Children like King, kids who are fighting cancer or have weakened immune systems, live in fear of infectious diseases. And if a child shows up sick to school with a disease like measles, it can kill them. We don't want to put him in an environment where he can basically die from picking up something that's preventable. And so state lawmakers are speaking out in a last minute push for support for their legislation that would end a religious exemption from vaccines. The largest measles outbreak has been in the ultra orthodox communities of Brooklyn and Rockland County. The religious exemption is a loophole. It is masking as um, someone's um, conspiracy against vaccinations and it needs to be closed. What's wrong is that they are putting the lives of other people in jeopardy and we as legislators have to do something about that by passing this legislation. And even with a health emergency declaration, fines and school closings, some people are still resisting vaccines. You are no friend of the religious. Passionate anti-vaxxers even showed up near the lawmakers afternoon press conference. This bill is against the First Amendment of the United States of America and this is a call for Donald Trump to stand up and protect the religious who do not want to comply with any coerced medicine. Governor Andrew Cuomo on the record today, he will sign a bill that ends a religious exemption in New York. This is a public health crisis and it's worse in New York than any other state. Uh, and I think we should pass a bill. Uh, you have a right to your religious beliefs. You don't have a right to infect my child. The city's health department says it will end its health emergency declaration here in Brooklyn only when the measles outbreak is over. As for Rockland County, they announced today they have renewed the state of emergency in the county and that will expire on June 24th.